Bubbly loop. Okay, class, is everybody ready for today's lesson? Yeah, 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 yeah. Today, we are going to talk about ED and ING endings. Everybody, please take a look at the board. Um, Ike, is there something wrong? Um, teacher, I'm boring. This class is no fun. I'm so boring. <laughs> Ike, well, I'm glad that you said that. You are? But he said that he's boring. Yes, I think what Ike wanted to say is that he's bored. Class is boring. And this is exactly what we're studying today. The difference between describing something, bored and boring. Does anybody know the difference? Uh-oh. Uh-uh. ED endings of adjectives describe how people feel, even how you feel. I feel bored. Right, Ike? Exactly. I feel bored. And ING endings are, are how something makes you feel. Class is boring. Class is makes me feel, since it's my feeling, I'm bored. The thing that is causing me to be bored is boring. Let's practice a couple, okay? I'm going to put some adjectives on the board and let's see who can answer. Let's start with the first one. We can say interested or interesting. Little drummer babe. I read the book, The Cat in the Hat. The book is... The book is interesting because I am interested in reading it. Interesting. The Cat in the Hat is interesting. Let's try another one. Little Madam Queen. The kids are excited for Disneyland or exciting for Disneyland. The kids are excited. They feel excited because Disneyland is exciting. It's correct. Please put your answer on the board. Very good. Okay, let's try another one. Let's try one with the example we heard earlier. My friend John is very bored or boring. What do you think? My friend John is very bored or boring. I, I'm confused. I think it could be both. Actually, Soul Babe, you're right. It can be both. My friend John is bored and my friend John is boring. But what is the difference? Hmm. My friend John is bored. That means that's how he feels. My friend John is boring is how John makes me feel. Oh yeah, my friend John is boring. He talks about trucks all day and cars and superheroes. I don't like that stuff. My friend John is boring. My friend John is boring. I feel bored. Yay! Yay! That was really good because that's a trick. What are you trying to describe? How people feel? How you feel? Or what's causing you to feel that way? That's a good one. Ike, this one's for you. My little brother Mike is annoying, annoyed, annoying, annoyed. My little brother, Mike, is annoying. He always bothers me. He's always touching my stuff. Good, and how do you feel when he bothers you? I feel annoyed. I feel annoyed. Oh, I get it, I get it. I feel annoyed. My brother is annoying. It's how he makes me feel. Great job. 
And so, Ike, class is? Class is interesting. I feel interested. Yay! You did an excellent job today. Now, let me ask you some questions. What's one habit you find very annoying? When do you feel annoyed? I'm, um, can I answer? Sure. I'm annoyed when it's snack time and I can't get my milk open. That's when I feel annoyed. Not opening my milk is annoying. That's a great answer. Who else? I'm excited when I get to play music in the band. Playing music is exciting. I feel excited. Great answer, little drummer babe. I feel bored when I can't play with my big sister. Playing by myself is boring. Great answers. Okay, let's do one or two more questions. When was the last time you were confused? When was the last time you felt confused? What was confusing? The last time I felt confused was at the start of this class. But now I think I get it. Great job. I want everyone to get with a partner I want you to make one sentence with each one of these adjectives. You can use ED or ING, and I'll come around and check. Little Madam Queen, can you tell me one of Ike's sentences? Yeah, Ike said that he thinks video games are interesting. And Madam Queen said that she gets excited about going shopping. Very good. What about you two? So, babe said she feels annoyed when her mama doesn't listen to her. Oh, that can be annoying. Drummer Girl said that she feels bored when there's nothing good to watch on TV. This is true. Okay, everybody, great job. Now, can you think of four sentences using ED or ING with each of these? That will be your homework for tonight. Okay, everyone. Until next time, bye.